it's Carrie Wilson, your Gel Moment Independent Distributor. And today I'm going to show you how to do this Mickey Classic French manicure. So we are first of all going to start off with champagne toast and we're going to roll it in our hands to mix it up. Never shake your bottles up and down because that will only put air into your gel polish and you don't want to put the air in it because you don't want to dry it out. So applying a second coat of the champagne toast and you want to make sure that you cap the edge of your nail so that it doesn't uh, peel off. So as you can see, I uh, you can see there's a slight ridge of polish that's on the tip of your nail. So you want to go back to the top of the cuticle, not touching your cuticle, but slowly make brush strokes to the tip so that that little uh, beaded gel blends in. And then you're going to want to cure it. Once your nail is cured, then you want to take the Quasar chrome powder that is a beautiful red chrome powder and just use your applicator and just apply your chrome powder to the freshly cured nail polish. Never uh, wait because you want it while it's still tacky in order for the chrome to adhere nicely to your nail. So once you get the desired look for your French manicure, you want to have it fairly, a fairly thick tip with red so that you can apply some white polka dots to that. So taking your lovey-dovey, I like to put it right out on my silicone mat because that is what it's for and I love that part of the silicone mat. And your uh, Raven's Kiss for the black, which will be the Mickey head. And take your dotting tool, I take the smallest tip, and I put it in the lovey-dovey, and then I just make little small polka dots within the red tip. And once you get that, the look that you like with your polka dots, then you're going to cure that for 45 seconds. And once it's curing, I cut a piece of the gold st styling strips. And then I'm going to apply that to the very top of the red quasar chrome powder tip. And then cut the extra styling strips off from each side. And I'm just getting it straight. I'm going to use my clippers. I'm going to clip that off the sides so that I'm going to make sure that I cut both sides of the styling strips off from the nail. And it's really coming along. So now we are ready to apply our top coat to seal the chrome and also seal that styling strip that we have on there. So I like to give a nice coat of the Clearly Frisky on top. And again, remembering to cap your nail and brush it forward again to smooth out the tip of the nail. Then you're gonna cure that for 45 seconds. And then once that's done, you're going to take the larger dotting tool and dip that into your Raven's Kiss and apply a large dot right on the gold styling strip off to the side and then applying two more dots for the ears completing Mickey's head and then placing it in the lamp. 